you might wonder what is the best way for my users to receive latest information through my WordPress website? Well, the best way to access your content is through your primary menu. It helps users navigate to the information that they need. Setting up a navigation menu on your website is a great way to organize your content and make it easier for visitors to find the information that they are looking for. WordPress has a built-in feature that allows you to create a primary navigation menu. This is Justin Valia from Team Learn Today. And in this SOP, we are going to learn how we can create a primary menu for our WordPress website. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So the first step is to actually get into your WordPress dashboard, go to your dashboard. In the left sidebar, what you want to find is the appearance options. And inside the appearance options, you will be finding menus as another option. So let's click on menus from right here. And as you can see, I don't really have any menus made since this is a very new website that I've created. So I don't have any menus. Um, you will have an option to either edit the menu or create another menu. So I'm going to click on create a new menu from right here. I do not have a primary menu on my website right now. So I am actually doing this just for you guys. So let's go ahead. We will name the menu primary menu. You can name it first menu, raw menu, whatever you wanted to name. Okay. And yes, from here, we're going to also click on our display location as primary menu. So yeah, let's click on create menu. And now what we can do is we can add pages. So for example, whatever pages you want to be displayed on your primary menu will be added from right here. So as you can see in the left section of this page, you will find pages and you can either go to most recent or you can go to view all and select from here whatever page you want to add to your primary menu. I'm just going to add home page and contact us for now. Add to menu and it starts appearing. You have multiple options to actually um, add different kind of things on your primary menu as well. For example, you can click on posts and you can add a post if you want any specific post that you have uh, recently uploaded and you really want your readers to read it on your uh, page as soon as they land on your website. You can put it on your primary menu just for a bit and then you can uh, edit it off later if you want. You can add some custom links. You can add in any categories that you have created for any particular post, multiple things that you can do from right here. So I just want these two pages to appear on my newly built website. So I'm just going to click on save menu right here and we will be done with our work. Yes, that's all done. Primary menu has been updated. So let's go to the website and check out how it looks like. There you go. I have contact us and I have my homepage appearing right here where my primary menu should appear. So there you go. We have successfully created a primary menu for our newly built website. Hope you enjoyed that video. In our next SOP, we will learn how we can create a secondary menu or a footer menu for our WordPress website. If you have any queries that you would like for us to address or make another SOP on that query, you can go ahead and comment it in the comment box down below. This is Jasmin Valia and I will see you in our next SOP.